Hi guys, this is my very first video. Um, g'day, how are you? Welcome to my channel. Grab yourself a drink, grab yourself a snack, and let's have a chit chat. Okay, so today for my very first video, I'm doing a tea move haul. I have a small bag and I have three medium sized bags and we'll just see how far we go. So first up we have Sorry about the crinkling. Let's grab my scissors. First up is a shawl, a black shawl, and it was, I paid $3.97 and it is now $3.39. And it's really pretty. Nice and see through. And it's quite pretty with tassels. So yeah, it's quite nice. I like that. Okay. Next item is a pack of 12 makeup sponges and they, they are, I paid $4.94 and my prices are all in Australian dollars and they are now $3.59 so that's just a pack of 12. No need to open them. Okay, next item is two hair clips. I've got them in, in black and in brown, and it's like a banana comb. So you put it behind your hair and pull it up. I paid for the two, one ninety eight, but they're sold out. So, but other vendors do have them, so it should be okay. You can find them elsewhere. Okay, next up, I have a beautiful little bird brooch. And I paid two seventeen, and it is now two fifty seven. Oh, where's the camera? Just there. So it's a little bird with little diamantes. It's quite pretty. A little brooch. Quite pretty. I really like that. I also I bought two, and I gave one to Mum. Okay, so I actually went on a on a little bit of a nostalgic thing I bought a whole heap of pins and this one was 348 and it's now sold out and it's Roger Rabbit that's quite cute they're really good quality and they're enamel the colors are brilliant and I really love it um, I recently bought a denim jacket and I really look forward to decorating it with all the different pins. So, and I did go a bit crazy, guys. I'm sorry. I bought an awful lot of these pins. And um, a lot of them are from shows that I used to watch when I was young. And this one I paid $3.48. And it's now $2.47. And I did get a price adjustment. And price adjustments when your vendor has that item and it goes cheaper then you will get the price difference but you have to click on the price adjustment in your orders and you can do that daily for up to 30 days so yeah that's pretty good okay so this one's the roadrunner again i really love love all these pins but i did go a bit crazy okay and there's an awful lot of them Okay, I also went and bought um, a pack, packet of stickers. Um, I didn't put the price on, but they're all NASA, so they're all space related. I recently went to NASA last October, and I just thought these were really cute. So, yeah, there's a whole bunch. Anyway, there's a whole heap of different ones and they're really good for journaling I make journals and when I do a space one these are perfect to put in with that so but unfortunately I didn't get a price I'm sorry okay next item is another badge um no surprise there okay so this one I paid $3.98 and it is now $2.83 and again I did get a price adjustment and it's just a switch game pad which my grandson and my daughter are crazy about switch so that's for them 
Okay, next up I have, oh, this one's really cute. This one's $3.48 I paid and it's now sold out, but other vendors do have them. They are still available. And it's Muttley from the Wacky Races, which I absolutely adore. I love his laugh. Makes me chuckle. Makes me happy. Okay. This one is another badge. <laughs> and it's... I paid $3.89, it's now $4.29. I'm not sure what the name of the animation was, but I really like it. I really like the girl in pink, she's got attitude, <laughs> like me. Yeah. Don't worry, I don't only do badges. I, what I might do is I might just keep the badges in this bag and just every time I do a haul, I might just do a a couple of them that way you don't get bored okay this one is I paid 339 it's now discontinued um, it's um, Mike and Sully from Monsters Inc they're just really beautifully detailed they're just gorgeous I'll just do a few more okay this one's this one is, I paid $3.49 and it's sold out. And this is the Jetsons. See how much detail's in them. They're just beautiful. The colours are vibrant. I just love them so much. All right, I'll just do two more. This one is my favourite TV show, which is Doctor Who. And I paid $3.59 and it is also sold out, but other vendors do have them. And that's just the Doctor Who. I think it's the classic 80s, beginning of the 80s, probably Tom Baker era. Okay, one more. I think I actually went overboard and I did buy a couple of extra um, of these badges. I did double up. So I'm going to be doing a giveaway. I think there's 12 or 13. So when I reach my first thousand subscribers, um, I will be doing a giveaway amongst other things. I might have to cut this one. Okay, this one I paid $3.99 and it's sold out, but other vendors have them. And of course it's Scooby-Doo and Shaggy. I just love that, it's cute. I do apologise about my fingernails, guys. I normally do have false nails on, but haven't been doing it for a while. Um, yeah, so like, smile until it hurts. Um, I do chew my nails. This picture here is one that I painted in 2011 because my dad was really into Van Gogh, and so I painted that. That was my very first oil painting I did. So... And Doctor Who actually does an episode of, um, called, um, what's his name, Van Gogh, Vincent, I think it's called. And this particular church is portrayed in the, in the um, episode and in it there's a monster that lives in there. So I actually went ahead and put two little eyes in the window, so I thought that was cute. Okay, next item. I'm going to leave the badges for a while. I don't want to bore you to death. Okay, so Erin from Everybody, uh, hey everybody, um, she does do a lot of these um, nails and I thought these were really pretty. I saw her haul them a few weeks ago and they're the handmade ones. I paid $5.99, they're now $5.09 and I did get a price adjustment and they're beautiful. I love them. So maybe I'll wear them next time. Okay, this is another shawl that I've already hauled in black. This is it in pink. And that's quite nice. I like that. So, yeah, lovely. I really like that. And that one's the same price as the other one, $3.97 I paid, and they're now $3.39. Okay, some more badges. We don't want to see those. Okay. What's in here? Unpack it. 
top, some more nails, and it came in a little plastic thing. I paid $6.64, and they're now $6.73, and that's them. And they come with a little nail file as well, and a cuticle pusher. So they're really pretty. Okay, next item. Okay, so this, I thought I'd better buy this because I'm buying so many badges. I thought I should buy this to put them on. So I paid $4.04 and it's now $4.48. And it's a little hanger that you hang up and you actually put all the badges, you stick them in through here. So, yeah, I might have to do that and put them all on there and then I'll show you when it's full. So I actually bought two of those. So I'll put that up there. Okay, next item is, oh, these are really pretty. Okay, so these are actually cards. They're greeting cards, but they're, they're the shape of a vase. So this one is, oh, I'm sorry, they're sold out. But I'm sure you can get them anyway. So this one, I paid 5 84 And what you do is it's so it's a card and you have an, an envelope as well and you when they get it they pop it out and it looks like a vase and you set them up to look like a bunch of flowers not sure exactly how it works yet but you fold them all a certain way and then they place them on the table and it's like they've been given a bunch of flowers so yeah, I thought that was really pretty. So yeah, and they're quite large, pretty. Nice colours. And that one is the pink Sakura. There you go. So there you go. Hey, everybody. <laughs> it's the, um, the Japanese peach blossom. Okay, so that's that one. And I did buy quite a few of these. So I also bought it in the Lily and it's this one's 748. And it's the same sort of thing but with lilies. And they're really pretty. I won't do all of them. I won't pull them out. But that's just so you've got an idea of what's available. So that's it in blue. And then I also got it in the Dahlia. This one I paid $7.49. It does say that it's discontinued, but I'm sure there's more than one vendor. And also, not just the envelope, it also comes with a little greeting card that you can pop inside as well. So you can put your little greeting in and pop it into, into it. So that's another one that they all pop out. They're pretty, they're just lovely. And you don't see these in the shop, so I think that if you give that to someone, it's quite nice. And then I bought the tulip one as well. And the tulip one's really pretty. And I paid $7.98 for the tulip. And it's also discontinued. I'm sorry. I seem to be picking all the things that are discontinued. But that's the tulip. So they're really pretty, aren't they? Such a lovely gift. So, yeah. So that's that one. And I think I did buy... I oh know. Yes, I did. I bought two of the tulip. So there's two of those. Because my mum, mum and dad, Dutch. My father's no longer with us, but my mother is. And so I like to give her like Dutch themed things sometimes. Okay, next item in the box, in the bag is. Oh, I doubled up, bought another packet of these. And again, $4.94, now $3.59. So a pack of 12 makeup sponges. Okay. This, I don't know if I should take it out of the packet. This was $21.98 and it's now $18.71. Um, I bought it in the Burgundy. It's a lounge or couch cover. Um, I had all my, all my furniture in my lounge rooms a bit odd bod. Some, some's leather, some is material. So I thought I'll buy the covers for all of them and match them up. So that this one's for a single seater. This is for my recliner. 
So yeah, you've got all the pieces you need to cover all the armrests and things like that. So that's in maroon, so, or burgundy. So I'll have to do that when I'm finished with the video. Okay, next item. I've just moved into a new home uh, last Sunday. And so I've been buying a lot of stuff for that, for the house. So I just bought sponges. There's 12 in a pack. I paid $2.97, they're now $2.72, so that's more cleaning. Okay, next item is, I bought this for my grandson, and this is, it's a, I think it's a spinner of some sort. I paid $5.35, it's now $3.77, and yes, I did get a price reduction. So, it's one of those things that you got to mess it all up and then, yeah, sort it out. So I have to give it to him all messed up. Otherwise, it's no challenge. So, yeah, so he'll, he'll get a kick out of that. Oh, and I did drop that. It does come with a little little um, tag to put on. I don't, oh, yeah, it goes in through the little hole there. There's a little hole here. So he can fiddle with that. I'm not going to worry about it. Okay, that can go up there. Okay, next up we have another hair clip. This time I have bought a smaller one and it's, I paid $2.39 and it's currently sold out, but other vendors do have them, I have seen them. So it's another sort of banana clip in a turtle shell. Yeah, so that's quite cute. Put this in there. Okay, these, I don't know why I bought these, <laughs> to be honest, but I think um, probably for my grandson, just something to do. Okay, so they're all little, they're little roly-polies and they're all different. And so you've got a little bear and they, I don't know if you can see it, but they actually, they rock. So yeah, so you've got the little penguin. And you've got, I don't know what that says, but it's a little a little animal of some sort, a little critter. And then you've got white ones. It's a little robot type looking thing. And then you have pink ones, which is a little penguin. So yeah, so they're all all little all little different ones. And they come in a pack of uh, 20. And I paid $3.15 and they're now $3.06. So they come in a little packet of 20. So maybe he can set them up and play bowling or camping bowling or whatever with them. So that's for him. Then I also bought him a pack of, there's 24 pieces. I paid $5.71 and they're now $5.19 and they're pullback cars. So they come in different different little, there's little planes, so Shannon D, there you go, there's a little plane for you, and then there's little cars, so they, they pull back and then they, they shoot off, so there's a whole pack, different colours, cars, planes, etc, etc, a whole pack, so that'll keep, hey, maybe he can set up those little these little things and then use the cars to run them over something like that anyway all good okay next item is it's one of those color change lipsticks that everybody likes i paid uh 89 cents i think and they had this they have plastic over the top of plastic okay so the it's green but then according to the color of your skin and i should go against the light there so it'll actually change color according to the acidity i believe in your skin so we'll come back to that later and see if it's made a difference so yeah so i paid 89 cents for that okay next item is oops and everything's falling out let's have a look 
so this is a pack of I believe 50 or maybe I paid 398 now 229 and they're instead of using pins when you're sewing they're little pegs and they're really good they come in different colors so there's a whole pack of them as I said for I paid $3.98, now $2.28, so I got a price adjustment on that. So yeah, so good for quilting, good for whatever. Okay, I don't remember what this, oh yes, I think it's a book stand. For this next item, I paid $1.52, they're now $1.67. And uh, I think it's a phone stand. Yeah, I think it's a phone stand or something like that. You put it down on the table and, yeah, you stick your phone in it. Or a book if you're doing recipes, cooking in your kitchen, put your recipe book in there and, yeah, so you can read what it says. Okay, next item is I bought some – I bought these for when I, when I cook and I have excess – um, food left over and I put them in a freezer container I've bought these labels and I have not put the price on it so I'm, I apologize I don't want to go look it up but yeah so there's a, probably about 50 or 60 in there and you can just write down the contents and when when you put it in so that you can keep an eye on your products that you're putting in your freezer so you know how old they are okay next up I have got a shelf for the shower this one I paid $5.29 it's now $6.74 and so it has suction cups that you can attach to the wall so it's actually quite pretty so it, that's what it looks like and these are the little the little clips that you take off there and then you clip it on onto your wall and you have a nice little caddy shower caddy to put all your soaps and your shampoos and whatnot in there okay next item oh dropped one sorry okay next item is this one is a is a gear shift um little cover I paid $3.60, it's now $2.35. I actually have it in blue as well, which I have in my car. So it's a little a little jacket that you pull over, you put over your gear stick, and then you tuck his little his little sleeves into the pockets. And it just gives it looks a bit tough. Or if you have reborn dolls, which I do, I make reborn dolls, and I also have little ones, um, little um, reborn dolls, and you can pop that on and it looks like an oody so yeah it's quite cute okay next item is okay I think I bought these to put in my sink um, it's a pack of three and they cost me $4.79 they're now $4.77 and they're little They've got little suction caps. You can put them in the bath or you can put them in your sink so that when you're washing small items so they don't go down the sink. So there's a pack of three. So that's pretty good value. Okay, next item. It's got a lot of smaller things in here. I'll just grab them out. Okay, so this is quite a big bag. Okay, so next item is $2.65, still $2.65. And they're just a cute little pair of scissors with the rainbow colours. They come with a little a little plastic cap so you don't stab yourself accidentally, which I almost did. So yeah, that's quite cute. Okay. Next up we have this is a little, uh, it's a fake or faux leather little notebook. 
Um, I paid, it says that it's leather, but I think it's faux leather. Um, $4.45 I paid, they're now $3.07. And they're just really cute for your handbag or if you just want to do a bit of journaling or whatever. A little notebook. It's quite nice. It's got a little engraving there. It doesn't go all the way around, only stops there. But yeah, it's quite nice. So I think that's cute. And I think it would be quite nice to give as a gift, which is what I might be doing. So it's got a quite cute little leaf at the end which matches the engraving so yeah, it's pretty okay next item is is do it yourself <laughs> nails um i paid 384 they're now 389 and they're really pretty they have different colors in them as you can see and they're quite pretty i like that okay next item up okay here we have uh, pack of 50 and they're 347 I paid and they're now 298 and they are these shiny bags they come in the pink and they come in the silver as well and they're just little see-through you can see through them um, and they're little you can either put lollies in for a party or you can put little bits of jewellery in. See, they are see-through. Or, yeah, just handy little packets. And you can use them for anything. And they're quite a decent size. So they're, you know, nice. I like them. I'm sure I'm going to find plenty of little things to put in those. Such as badges, maybe. We'll see. Okay, ah, speaking of badges, let's do one. Okay, I should do a joke for every badge I do, shouldn't I? No, you'd get bored. Okay, so this badge is, I paid $2.37 and it's now $2.49 and it is Van Gogh, but it's the TARDIS in Van Gogh, which I love. And it's in the shape of a stamp, which I think is really cute. Yeah. Done. Okay, next up we have some more of those pegs for sewing. Then next up I have a little little first aid kit. And actually when, when I know someone who has just gotten their license, I actually um, buy them a little first aid kit. A little bit better than this. This is just one that you can put in your backpack if you're going hiking or whatever. But I usually buy them for a gift for getting their license, which I've done with all of my kids. I give them a, a decent first aid kit that they can leave in their car. Okay, this one was only $3.59 I paid, and it's still $3.59. And it's actually, inside it has a triangle bandage for if they break an arm. It has a little gauze, tape for the gauze. It has a pair of tweezers, plastic ones though. It has a little packet of um, safety pins. It has some alcohol wipes. It has one bandage that size. It has two sterile gauze. It has a tiny weeny pair of scissors which are more like preschool scissors that probably don't cut much. And it has a face mask. And it has another pack of five little band-aids. So they're really that's really handy for if you're, like I said, just going backpacking or uh, not backpacking, if you're going hiking, just for the, a day trip, just if you get an ouchie from when you, maybe you get a, a bite being out in the forest or whatever. So yeah, so that's just a cute little thing, and it wasn't didn't cost that much. It was what what did I say it was? Three fifty nine. I mean, come on, that's that's less than a cup of coffee. So that's good. I like that. Or should I say coffee for the American friends? Okay, next up we have. I paid a dollar thirty two. It is now a dollar forty six, and it is. Oh, I bought this one for my grandson. He's obsessed with monsters and anything like that and it's one of these little aliens 
and his eyes pop. It's quite, quite gross. Yeah. I think Erin from Hey Everybody hauled one, but one of her eyes didn't work. So, but yeah, this one does. It's quite cute. Okay, next up we have some more of those stickers. We bought another pack. And this time I did put the price on. I paid $2.65 and there is a hundred, a hundred in here, a hundred stickers. And now they're a dollar eighty-six. So I did get a price adjustment on those. Okay. Next up we have oh. okay, so this is a 24 litre container. I paid $12.99, they're now eleven ninety-seven. And what it is, I actually bought two of these. I gave one to my grandson for toys. So what it is, is it pops up and it's got these little metal things in which you pop open, like so. Which I will just try and do that again. It's good to put all my little hauled items in. Okay, let's have a look. So that's, that's what it looks like. And it has a zipped little window. So this has got a little window and it's clear so you can see, but you can also open the top up and get in through the top. So depending on where you place it. So yeah, that, that's a decent size. You can probably fit maybe four to six pair of thongs in there or four pairs of normal shoes, four pairs of runners, whatever and pop them under your bed or on top of a wardrobe, whatever. So that's really handy. And um, as I said, I gave my grandson one and he uses it as a little toy box in his room. Okay, so that's that. And there's one more item. No, two more items in there. Okay. No, or is there more? No. Okay. We have next item is a I believe it's a mascara. It's a 24 hour mascara. I paid $349 and it is still $349. And it's a great lash. Great lash. And of course there's more plastic. Oh, just got rid of it. I must admit, Timu do wrap their products very well, sometimes too well. <laughs> okay, so that's quite nice. It's quite a good, decent brush. I won't put any on because I've got mascara on already. Okay, so there's that. Okay, next item is, this is um, for those of you who have pets in the house, which I don't, I don't like pets in the house because I don't like cleaning up the hair. Um, it's a pet hair remover, and I actually bought it for my brother. Um, so it's, I paid $197, it's now $129, and it's just a, just a, one of those pet hair removers, and on the back it's got actually a metal, actually no, it's not for, for removing pet hair off furniture, although you could use it for that, this side, but I think you can actually use it on your pet's because my dog molts, she loses um, her winter coat quite often. Um, and yeah, so you pull that across their fur and it actually pulls it out. Well, I think that's what it's for. Correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> okay, next item. Okay, this is a jelly, called a jelly lipstick. And I paid $1.99, they're now $2.48. And it's... Oh, there's that other one. Look, it's gone pink. See? So that's quite nice. Yeah. Uh, I don't know whether it must be a colour changing one. So I'll put that next to this one. I'll put it over here. So we'll see what happens. Okay, so that's what it looks like now. We'll check it out later. Okay, so that's all of that bag. We'll go to the next bag. Bag number three. I'm running out of room on here. Okay, we'll do another badge. Why not? Okay, this one I paid $1.97 and it's now $1.67. 
and it is ah, da, da, da. Oh, it's a cup of coffee. That's cute. And I will do a joke. I'll do a joke every time I do one. Okay, here's the joke. What do you do? What do you get when you cross a snowman with a vampire? Frostbite. I'll cut that one off. That's pretty pathetic. These are more like dad jokes, so bear with me. I just thought I'd do something different. Okay, next item. Next up we have a packet of 12 or 10. Packet of two, four, six, eight. Packet of ten sponges. They're double-sided. And I bought that because I love cleaning. I paid $4.17. They're now $1.27. Massive difference. And I did get a price adjustment. Price adjustments are great, guys. I sometimes get over $20 um, cash back. So it's well worth doing your price adjustments every day. Um... I usually do the price adjustments and then I do my games, Fishland and, and Farmland, and I have just received my first Fishland gifts uh, the other day. However, I was a bit disappointed because when I first chose the gifts, uh, they were really good, like um, really good value gifts, and then as you get towards the end, um, all of a sudden they were out of stock, so then they let you check uh change your um, gift for something else that's available and of course what's available after that i think what i ended up with is a toilet brush and a silicon baking mat and something else that i can't even remember that's how you know they they weren't that good but anyway it was free okay next up i have a pack of uh table table protectors uh, chair protectors so you put them on the bottom of your chair and they come in a pack of this is for uh i believe four there's 16 in there so it's for four chairs and they're little little socks for you and they do conform to either square or circle even though it's a circle it will accommodate a square leg so you put them on because I have all tiles in my new house and so and they're all white bane of my existence uh, all I've done is sweep and clean since I've lived here for less than a week um, I have to sweep at least twice a day because you see everything on it which is a bad thing but it's also a good thing because it's always clean you keep it clean so yeah so there's enough there to do four chairs and so I bought two packs because I have to buy an eight seater table set now because um, my house is twice the size of what I had before so there's that okay next item is okay so this little item is a set of self-adhesive cabinet door bumpers um, if you have doors on your wardrobes that make a bit of noise or don't you know they're, they're a little bit little bit of space in between you put these little silicon bumpers in um, I think this is a pack of 10 or 12 and I paid 374 they're now 399 and they're little oh no that you get more than sorry you do get more you get 10 20 30 40 so there's 40 of these in there and what it is is they're adhesive and they're like a silicon you see that and so you put that on one side and then you peel off the protective layer and then stick it on and then yeah so yeah, there you go you have a little bumper that stops the noise on your cupboards you can use it for anything really um you can use it on kitchen drawers if you've got a kitchen drawer that makes an awful noise or something like that and of course because they're silicon they're not going back in the packet easily I'm starting to sweat because it's hot. Okay, that light's really bright. Okay, I, I hauled that light, um, but I needed it as well as the stand I'm using for my iPad. So uh, I can't remember what I paid. I think it was just over $20 for the stand and probably $25 or $27 for the light. So yeah. Okay, next up. This is a set of two um, toilet... Um, toilet lid little holders I'll show you what it means I paid 
229, they're now 228. So what it is, it's a little, it's, I hate touching toilet lids, um, especially because I've got a house full of boys. Um, but they're little, cute little, this is the rose gold, and you have a little sticker, you put it on there, and then you stick it onto the toilet lid, like so, or the other way, like that. And then when you, you just lift that to lift up the toilet seat rather than using your hands on the toilet seat. Yuck. So, yeah, I'm a bit precious. So there's a set of two. Okay, next up. Okay, these are really nifty. So these are, you get 40 pieces and they're, I paid $1.99. They're now $2.20. And what they are is they're great for your medicine cabinet. Now, I'll just open one up to show you what it is. So this is this has got iodine in it, right? So they're sterile. So you, I'll have to cut that. I'm sure there's a little thing that you can use to open it, but um, okay. So there's two sides, right? So it's an, it's, it's a, like a cotton bud, right? The ear bud. But one side, I don't know if you can see, it has a little red line. So you crack that one, right? And there's iodine in here. So if someone's hurt themselves, right? You crack this bit and what happens is the iodine leaks into the bottom. See, it goes into the bottom one and then you use it to wipe the saw and disinfect it. That's really good. And then you can just throw it away, just like that. Brilliant. Okay, and it dripped all over my Thing. All good. Where's my sponge? Uh -huh. I'll just open my sponge. There we go. Look. And look how well that works. Very good. Okay. Well done. So there's 40 of those. And as I said, $1.99. So that's really good to add into your medicine thing. Okay. Next up, my husband's a bit older than me by about 20 years. So he... Um, is not so stable on his legs in the shower anymore. And we've got a walk-in shower. So I saw on Timu they have these wonderful little things. And I paid, for the blue one, I paid $3.48. It's now $1.69. Brilliant. It's got suction cups on this side. You put it into the shower and you can either put it on the wall to rub your back or I bought a pink one as well. But the pink one cost more. It was $2.08 I paid. It's now also $1.69. Or you can put them on the, the floor and wash your feet. My husband had both his knees replaced a few years ago and can't lift his knee up. He can't wash the bottoms of his feet. So he, I said, I saw these on Timu and I thought I'll get one for the wall, which is this one, and one for the floor so he can wash his feet. You just put soap, liquid soap or whatever on there and then just rub your feet on it and his feet will be washed. So I thought that was brilliant. So that's those two. Right, next up we have a pair of pajamas. I have not, oh, I have got the price. Okay, I paid $9.79. They're now, oh, sorry, $7.97. Dyslexic, sorry. Uh, now it's seven fifty-seven. The yeah, dyslexia. Sometimes the letters are mixed up. Okay, so it's a pair of shorts, and I got it in the extra large. I just thought it was really cute. So there's that, and I think I did buy these in different colours. So there's more coming, and then there's the little the little top. So yeah, it's quite cute. Okay. Next up, we have, okay, so that's it for that bag. All right, so I got some tins, and these, this one's binary code. I don't know if you can see. It just, I just like all this sort of stuff. So there's binary code. I also bought Morse code. Now, the Morse code one I paid $4.49. Um, the binary, I can't believe I paid um, $8.39 for that one. I don't know what I was thinking. 
and this one I paid six twenty eight, and this one's ancient and mystical alphabets, which I thought was really nice. So, if you want to send a letter in Morse code or secret letter to your lover, use that. Nobody'd be the wiser. Okay, next item, and we're already forty five minutes in. Wow, unreal. Okay, next item I paid. Ten ninety seven. Oh, excuse me. I bought this one in a two XL because I thought I'd need it. It feels. This feels like it's just been ironed on. It feels really cheap, and it feels like it's going to fall off in the first wash. I don't know if it will, but. And. It feels a bit like, bathing material. It's really stretchy. It's made of. Ninety five percent polyester and five percent elastane, but. But I thought it was really cute. I like that print, but I don't know. It feels, I'll give it a wash, see what happens. Same as that. I don't wear anything from the shops before they're washed because um, China is known for using formaldehyde, which is what the ancient Egyptian used for mummification. Um, it's a very potent um, chemical. Sorry, I'm sweating. And, um, Yes, they actually dip their clothes into them when they're manufactured and it keeps bugs and things off and formaldehyde is really bad for our skin. If it actually, even if you wash the clothes, it can take up to six or seven washes before all of it's out of your clothes. So it can be quite potent. So I wouldn't risk wearing any of the clothes before I wash them. Okay, next up we have, again, this is also for my shower. Um, as I said, we've got a walk-in shower and all it has is a, one little tiny glass shelf that has um, a place to put my stuff. So there's no little shelf to put your feet or anything. So this, this item I paid $9.98. It is now $9.09. And it's actually a shelf. You put it on the wall and you suction cap it quite tight and you put your feet up there either for my husband if he wants to wash his feet that way or for me, when I want to shave my legs, I just pop my foot up on there, put it up high, and then I can shave my legs easily without not having anywhere to shave and then having to bend down and maybe slipping. So that's for me. Okay, I have another bag. One more bag. I've already opened. Okay. There's not many items in this bag. But Got a box which I will well, everything's bouncing around. Okay. Oh surprise, surprise, more badges. Oops, sorry. I won't be doing many of those. Oh my goodness. I really went all out because I saw I went into I saw someone haul a badge and I thought, oh they're cute. And of course I went in and started looking at all the different badges and I thought, oh, that so reminds me of all the TV shows I used to watch. So, oh, I apologise. I won't do them all. I'll do maybe one or two. Okay. Which are stuck to the box. So how about we do them? Okay, so I paid $1.99. It's still $1.99. And it is, oops, I lost the back of it. This is um, Frida. We all know who Frieda is. I thought that was cute. Okay, so that's that one. Next up we have, oh, I'll just keep that. This one is, I paid $1.94. It's still a $1.94 and it is, <laughs> it's It from the Adams Family. I think that's what he's called, It. Little hand, yeah. Okay, so that's that. Okay, next we have a box. This one I paid. Uh, what did I pay? Oh, okay. I paid $128 for this one. It is a reborn doll. It's a silicon doll. And um, I do make reborn dolls. I don't make silicon dolls. I do the silicon vinyl with the um, cloth bodies. 
so occasionally what I will be doing is um, this channel I will also be doing um, arts and crafts um, showing arts and crafts maybe even a reborn doll or two that I have made um, this is a little preemie baby um, comes with a little bottle which I fill up with fake milk okay so it's wrapped quite well it's quite squishy um, I actually have a, I've actually bought a, a, a boy and a girl this is the little girl I haven't got the boy yet um, so I bought the same ones but they're anatomically correct so I won't be showing that um, but what I, I wanted to do them as a pair of twins so um, I thought that would be quite cute because I have little knitted outfits oh she's adorable oh my goodness oh my goodness she's dressed already and she's quite squishy stretchy oh my goodness she weighs a ton she's so heavy she's so cute oh look at her face oh she's adorable oh she's got a flat head Timu, that's not right. What happened there? No, I don't like that. No, I guess if I put some hair in there, it will be all right. Anyway, I'm happy with her. I think she's cute. She's quite squishy. She's got quite a little belly. Little, little, little belly. Little belly button. I like it. It's cute. I think it's very cute. I like it. How's that? She's all over the place like a little baby. Oh, support that head, please. Okay. So anyway, I've got a boy coming as well. So see how that goes. And um, yeah, anyway, all good. I will show you her when I've got her in her own little outfit that I've got. Okay, guys, well, that's it. That's all I've got for now. I hope you enjoyed um, my first ever haul. Um, I've had fun doing it. And we'll see what happens. I've got more orders coming. So until next time, um, you know, be nice to each other, be kind and appreciate you coming to visit and I hope you'll stay and subscribe. Press either the thumbs up, thumbs down, whichever. Um, yeah, and I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.